So good morning and welcome to today's video. British Summer's done us proud again, it's raining. Um, we're off today to Gold Hill, Zigzag Hill, and we've also checked in King Alfred's Tower. So we've got three iconic climbs today in the wet. 135k I think it is, so it's our longest ride of the year and we've chosen the wettest day to do it on. Yes, yeah, so if you haven't guessed yet, there's six of us today. So it's me, Justin, Del, Alex, Pete, and Ian. So sort of the normal crew. And this ride, everybody seems to be a little bit scared of how far it is, but it is only 135K. It's the, it's the three climbs. And at the moment, with this weather, we're not sure about Gold Hills cobbles, because that could be lethal. It's a 25%, 50 second to a minute climb on cobbles. But the first up on the menu is King Alfred's Tower, which isn't all that far away. So <laughs> Pete's never done that one. It is a bit of a wall. It's about 7% until you get around the corner. And there is a video on King Alfred's Tower. I'll stick at the end. So if you've not seen that ride, a little bit more in detail about the climb, but it is a monster. Right, so who has and who hasn't done this climb before? King Alfred's Tower. King Alfred's Tower, yeah. Uh, a long time ago. But yeah, I've done it a, a long time ago, yeah. So Pete, you're the newbie. Have you done it, Alex? Yep. So Alex, Alex and Pete are the newbies. Yep. Your first attempt was the first ride with the club. Yeah, it was. <laughs> really? Yeah. First ride with the club. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Mike, Mike brought her up here for her first ride and she came back. I did. Anyway, everybody's stripping off. It must mean business. A bit warm, so I've taken my jacket off as well. Let's go do it. King Alfred's Tower. I don't know why I put it on the route. It's just to see Pete go up it, to be honest. <laughs> I don't like this vibe. The There's a tower up there and the wall. There goes Justin. Oh. I'll admit, that last bit's pretty steep. Darren said there was a flat bit in the middle, but. I didn't feel any flat on there. You alright? I've got an inhaler. <laughs> Climb up to the tower, we didn't actually mean up to the tower. We meant here. <laughs> you got about the steps inside now? Yeah, how's that for you? We are there today. <laughs> I was just saying, I didn't feel a flat bit in the middle. <laughs> I definitely went too hard at the bottom. Pretty steep at there. It's at pretty the steep at the top, yeah. You just yeah. gotta dig in on that last bit. You can see the top. Yeah, that's pretty steep. Yeah, it's 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 pretty but still really hard. <laughs> How does that make sense? Because it is hard. I need more gears. Pete. I think I had more gears last time. It doesn't get any easier, you just get mm. faster. That's, well, that's what they say. I, my time will tell. That's the tower over there. Off now uh, on our way to Shaftesbury in Gold Hill. Uh, I think we've got to climb before we get into Shaftesbury, but I haven't told them that. They'll find that out soon enough. We've got to climb up to Shaftesbury then, and then we've got Gold Hill. If it's doable in the rain, it has actually stopped raining, but the wind's gone up a bit, so hopefully it'll dry out a little bit by the time we get there. Euphoria. Right, so we've arrived in Shaftesbury. Now we gave Steve Cox some stick last week because he got lost. Justin and Ian have just gone the wrong way, and Justin has the route on his Garmin. <laughs> he has no excuse. <laughs> So we're just hanging around waiting for Justin to catch up a minute. You've got the map, Justin. How have you gone the wrong way? I've followed the wrong road. <laughs> right, so Alex got to the bottom and had a look up. She's turned around and gone back, so we're waiting for her to come up now. So hopefully 
she's seen what it is and she's going to come up and have a proper go. Ali, 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 come on, Alex. Go on. Go on, beast it. Go on. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Push, 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 push. Go on. Go on, keep going. Push, push. Keep going right to the left. Go on, 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 go on. Yay! Well done, Alex. No. No. How was that? Really scary. <laughs> just, just a bit bumpy. I did it. You did it. Everybody did it. Great effort. So this climb was made famous in 1980 by a TV advert for Hovis Bread when a young lad went down on a rattly old bike, freewheeling all the way down with his legs out the pedals. We won't be doing that today. That is for certain. <laughs> zigzag hill now this is a beautiful climb it's got a few switchbacks at the bottom then it opens up into the top where there's some stunning views hope you enjoy this one we're definitely gonna much more than the last couple <laughs> especially with everybody watching on gold hill bit of pressure for alex but she did a magnificent job getting up there but this one we're just going to tap up and enjoy are you going for it yeah it's climb isn't it <laughs> <laughs> well there you go That was so lush. Oh, I want to do that again. <laughs> yes, yeah, so that was Zigzag Hill. Such a beautiful climb, lovely twisty. It's only drawback. This is a main road and it is a bit busy with cars. So, Peter, what a climb that What did you think of that one? That is such a good climb. The views are unreal. It's not steep, it's just. No, it's quite it's, fast. It's, it's, it is a beautiful climb, that one. That's, that is absolutely stunning. Three very different climbs today. That one's my favourite, I think. Only the second time I've done it, but I would definitely come all the way down here again just to do that climb. Like the descent? Yeah, that was quick. I like that. Yeah. Nice straight road as well. No bends. Just yeah, one bit in the middle. Yeah. <laughs> Shall we crack on? Time's getting on. Still some more views to see, more sights, more climbs. So we've done the uh, three iconic climbs, but we've only done 70k of 135, so we're literally halfway. <laughs> we've got to make it all the way back yet. At least the sun's out. <laughs> yeah, we, we are only halfway, Del. <laughs> Deja vu. How do you feel like we were here last week? So you're thinking food? Yeah, first dinner. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I felt. Are when you I, done, Alex? Last time I came here. Not that far to go. 50k. Oh, yeah. So the second coffee stop is done. Although we did all have a Coke in the end, just to refresh, get a bit of sugar in. Well, I do feel remarkably good this week. So uh, even though we've done all the big climbs, Still feeling really good, so hopefully that lasts. Today I think we've done three counties, but currently we're in the middle of Dorset and Somerset. No man's land. So we're in no county. <laughs> Into the night. 
It's a bit windy, Pete, so I don't know whether you'll hear me. But this segment is called Dead Man's Hill. Oh God. That doesn't sound good. Probably a few of us were <laughs> the road Doesn't sound good at all. Now, ladies, Justin's just announced that's the last hill today. No, it's Garvin today. Yeah. yeah. Don't believe him. Do we get a TikTok dance at the end today, Del? Oh, <laughs> yeah, a weird one. <laughs> <laughs> So that's, um, that's twice today, we just didn't got the route, they've gone the wrong way. What are we going to do with him? Grand and glorious. It's hard to tell whether people have just run out of things to say to each other or it's that point in the road where the group's just gone quiet. Right, so Justin has one of the club records for one of the longest points of changes ever. Got uh, Most of the times he's got lost on one ride. Twice on one ride and he's got the map and the route on his Garmin. And he skipped the beginning of the route as well. <laughs> Yeah. He's only done half the ride. This is the furthest I've ever ridden. Is it? Oh, yes. What, to this point? Probably. <laughs> Your first 100 miler today? I said if well, she's two kilometres away from 100, she has to do that. She has to cycle around the village, yeah. And then everybody's got to give you kudos on Strava. So there we go. Three iconic climbs. 133 kilometers or more, that's 1600 meters of climbing. One epic ride, um, a little bit further for Ian and Pete and Justin and Alex, who are all gonna be not far away from 100 miles today. So great effort from them, give them some kudos on Strava. But thank you for watching and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and we will see you again very, very soon. I think we've got a few videos planned this week. So hopefully, uh, yeah, it won't be too long till you see us in the next one. But thank you for watching, we'll see you soon.